The BJMP has informed the Sandigan Bayan that plunder convict Janet Limnapoles has been transferred to the Women's Correctional Institute in Mandaluyong last January, January 4. Napoles had been detained at the Camp Bagong Diwa in Taguig City. She was ordered transferred to the correctional following the anti-graph court's ruling in December that found her guilty of plunder over the, over the multi-billion peso pork barrel scam. Reuters reports that a U.S. Navy ship sailed near the disputed islands in the South China Sea amid Washington's ongoing trade talks with Beijing. USS MC Campbell carried out a freedom of navigation operation as it sailed within 12 nautical miles of the Paracel Islands to, quote, challenge excessive maritime claims. China, however, cries foul, accusing the Americans of provoking the Middle Kingdom. And Malacanang refuses to meddle in the dispute between China and Taiwan. Presidential spokesman Sal Panelo says the Philippine government will only step in if there's any issue involving overseas Filipino workers. Taiwan President Chai Ing-wen has been pushing for the sovereignty of Taiwan and has been refusing to be part of the One China policy. Chai has also been calling for international support in Taiwan's cause. The Duterte administration has been keeping close ties with China, with President Xi Jinping even visiting Manila in 2018. It's between the two countries. Tayo ang concern natin yung mga OFWs. Pag medyo may problema doon, arising out of that conflict, saka tayo kikilos for the safety of our OFWs.